Do you want your types projects to look even sharper and compile faster? Hey, I'm Martin. And together, let's dive into three of the game changers in Types.12. Let's get started with this article. As you can see, it has two columns. Now, I want to add this chart made with sets as a figure. Sets is a great package for creating charts. Previously, I floated all figures to the bottom with set figure placement bottom, but this chart is just too wide for a single column. Types.12 solved this with scope parent, allowing floats to use the whole page, not just a column. And it's versatile. You can apply it to individual figures or across the entire document layout. The best way to iterate on documents are comments right in your markup with Types Pro. But sometimes you'll have to share a PDF instead. If you do, your colleagues will appreciate line numbers. And don't worry, we've made it easy to add line numbers with just one command. Set par line numbering one. You can do any numbering and you can also customize whether they are counted by page or throughout the whole document with a set rule. In this update, we've also tuned the performance of some of Type's most used systems. Let's see how this plays out. I've loaded up this project with a lot of text, images, figures, and package usage in both Types.11.1 and Types.12. As you can see, Types.12 compiles this huge document much faster. Even the previews after the first compilation appear much quicker now. And the PDF that Types.12 produces is significantly smaller than previously. Finally, if you need to archive your PDFs, we've got you covered. We've added a checkbox for producing files in the easily archivable PDF A to B format. That's it for today's Types update. Let us know in the comments how you plan to use the new features and subscribe to this channel to stay in the loop. Until next time, happy typesting.